here. So like I always say, uh, there will be no time to waste any time. We need to go deep into these things straight and fast. You know, this video is going to be how to analyze the market. You understand? Now we're going to go into the monthly chart and then we do the top down analysis. Okay. Now, based on this USDJPY I'm looking at, okay, we want to find the important levels of this market. Pay attention to this video because it's going to help you a lot. Okay. These are the important levels of the monthly chart when it was going down. Okay. Now, we're going to find, you know, look at this is sitting on a very important support. Okay. Right here. Sitting on very important support. Right here. And then right here. Okay. Now, <clears throat> we're going to go find something. This is the major, major resistance. Okay. The major resistance. And then this is the major support of the monthly chart. Okay. Pay attention to this. Okay. Now, what is going on? Right from this zone, this one is sitting on a very important um support right here all right if i have to do one more thing i will take it this way like yes there was a breakout of a major support trend line which we have this up moves all this thing shows we are going up look at the the major the major support and look at another support this is higher than this then we're going up then we pick up a trend line and then we do what boom this is where we're going we are going up okay if we're going up then we have a tp around this level you see and we have a stop loss below this level okay now let's go down to the weekly and see how it looks like look this is your analysis very simple monthly chart weekly chart these are your friends we are going up okay now where do we go find our entries you know this is the time we go back down into the one hour time frame and then look at what is going on the one hour time frame what are we going to do here just tell me that look we find out the one hour is going up but the one hour will not always respect a trend line okay when it breaks the trend line and came down okay because the trend is a up on the monthly chart so what we're going to do with the one hour is every time the one hour is about to go up we put a buy entry you see this is where we need something that can help us to know when one hour has come down and is about to go back up we need anything like a buy sell arrow indicator and we need anything like a support resistance you know these are the things we need. You see, I'm not going to waste time on this video, but I believe that um, I've covered some important thing in this video, which, you know, you find it like mm, makes sense. Makes sense. Okay. This is how to analyze the market. There's no other way to analyze the market but this. When you have done your top-down analysis from the monthly, you look at the weekly, are they going up? Yes, they are going up. Then what you do, you switch to the one hour. Whenever it comes down, you find a place to buy and put your entry with your support resistance tool or your buy sell arrow indicator. And that's all. Okay. Now, let me go further by doing some other things like let us even remove all this support resistance line. And, and and see what we got right here and i'm also short of time now you know i'm short of time now but the video the message has been passed yeah the message has been passed you need to practice practice brings you to perfection okay practice brings you to perfection let's go to the one hour and this is how we came to the end of this video hmm. keep the practice going